Good afternoon, everybody. I want to welcome you to City Hall here in Brockton. Uh, I want to thank BCA for always filming these wonderful events that we do. Uh, today, we are honoring uh, wonderful people from Mexico that have come to the city of Brockton to call it home or have opened up businesses in our city of champions. I want to thank a couple of folks that are in attendance you can't see, but they're always here supporting uh, all of the diversity in the city of Brockton. Our city clerk, uh, Tim Cruz, thank you, Ms. Clerk, for being here. Uh, we have Tim, all right. Tim Sullivan, school committee member from Ward 7, who never misses one of these. Thank you very much. And on behalf of Senator Mike Brady, Jim, thank you for being here on behalf of the Senator. I want to thank uh, my office. I want to thank Suzanne McCormick for uh, working on these events. Uh, I want to thank Courtney Henderson and Jasmine Bradshaw and Kevin Blaze. I want to thank our wonderful new intern. I want to thank John Messia. I want to thank uh, Celia Canavan. I want to thank... Uh, uh, Sydney Merrill, my chief of staff, who is not here today. I want to thank Stephanie. I want to thank Alicia. We have a great team. So just to let you know, today we celebrate the country of Mexico's Independence Day. And again, I am so thankful uh, to be able to do this on a regular basis. Mexico, once known as uh, the nation of New Spain, was a colony harshly ruled by the Kingdom of Spain for over 300 years. The native population was oppressed. Farmlands and personal wealth was confiscated and stolen. Um, on September 16th in the year 1810, the Mexican people demanded the end of Spanish rule, and in 1821, Spain finally withdrew and officially recognized Mexico as an independent nation, an independent country. Mexico is the 10th uh, most populous country in the entire world. A dominant language, of course, is Spanish, spoken in Mexico. It's one of the most visited countries in the entire world. The hospitality industry is one of uh, Mexico's biggest industries due to the beautiful beaches, uh, rich historical sites, and the many resorts uh, throughout the nation. Around the world, Mexico is also known uh, for celebrating on November 1st, uh, Dia de los Muertos, which is the Day of the Dead. Pretty good, was that okay, Courtney? All right, all right, Brockton High Spanish. Um, this holiday is a joyful celebration involving family and friends gathering to pay respect to uh, also remember friends and family members who have passed on. Some of Mexico's native culinary ingredients include maize, tomato, bean, squash, chocolate, vanilla, avocado, guava, uh, coffee, and a variety of chilies. Tequila is a distilled al alcoholic drink uh, made from the acave cacti, and it really is the largest uh, exporter of um, uh, distilled spirits coming out of Mexico around the world. Um, so at this time, I would actually like to um, read the proclamation, uh, official mayoral proclamation, whereas September 16, 1810, in an act that demonstrated the resolute spirit that has characterized its culture through the ages, Mexico declared its independence from Spain after over 300 years of colonial rule, whereas Brockton's greatest strength is our diverse population, including residents and business owners from Mexico who have enriched the city uh, and the community by the introduction of Mexican customs, food, history, and culture. Whereas it is an honor to always recognize the accomplishments and contributions of our citizens in the city of Brockton and today of those of Mexican ancestry and to extend to them best wishes for continued health, success, and prosperity. Now, therefore, I, Robert F. Sullivan, as mayor of the city of Brockton, the city of champions, on September 16th in the year 2024, proudly proclaim today in our fine city as Mexican Independence Day. And I respectfully urge all residents in the city to uh, please join me in observing this special day. At this time, uh, I'm gonna ask Tim Sullivan, who always comes, always comes, if you would mind raising the flag right now. Again, we want to thank everybody for being here, um, city employees uh, that always come. Uh, I also want to give a shout out to Brian Matter, uh, 
who always helps set up when we do the interior ones. We continue to do the interior flag raisings because of the exterior construction. So out of abundance of caution and safety, we will continue to do them inside. Uh, but about in a year's time, we'll be back outside. Uh, this coming Friday, uh, we'll be doing another one. Uh, Armenian Independence Day, so all of the wonderful uh, people that live and work in the city of Brockton of Armenian ancestry, we will be back here to honor and recognize you. But today, again, those that have come uh, from Mexico to our city, we thank you, uh, we applaud you, and we truly, truly appreciate what you do each and every day. Thank you very much. Have a great day, everybody.